Hey everyone, Mike here and in this clip I'm going to show you how to sync uh, your iTunes content with the Samsung Galaxy S5 and that helps you transfer all your movies and your, video and your videos, your podcasts, books, music, whatever from your iTunes account to the Samsung Galaxy S5 uh, if you're planning to switch from an iPhone to this uh, new Samsung device. Okay, for that uh, I'm using a PC, but uh, the same process is available for a Mac as well. Uh, I need to, uh, my iTunes account uh, on the uh, uh, installed on the computer, and I've uh, already created a backup of my phone on this uh, computer. Um, the next step uh, requires you to go to Samsung's website, samsung.com/us/smart-switch. Um, and in here, you need to download uh, the um, you need to download the smart switch for PC or the smart switch for Mac application. In this case, I've downloaded smart switch for PC, uh, and then you install it, and then you just launch it. Okay, let me see where is it. Okay, and when you launch it, uh, you'll get to this particular screen. You'll need to connect your phone to the computer via the USB cable included in the pack, like this. And once you do connect it, the application will see this, uh, this phone. And from here, you get to transfer a backup from Andre's iPhone to the new Samsung Galaxy press next and uh, this screen reads up the backup and should uh, let you select what you want to transfer from one computer to from one uh, device to the other but let's wait for it to load okay there we go I can transfer my contacts my uh, calendar my messages my memos can also transfer my music videos and photos uh, my alarms and my uh, phone uh, phone log from what it seems and of course my bookmarks and uh, you can select what you want from this and just hit start transfer and wait for wait for the software to do what it does will take a couple of minutes probably okay so once once it's done you'll get this uh, this message and you just have to tap end or done or whatever it is and now all of that content should be available on the Samsung Galaxy S5 so yeah I have my camera content from the iPhone on uh, my camera the uh, my content from the iPhone on this particular device and actually moving everything was really really easy all right that's about it for now thanks for watching if you have any questions uh, leave them below and uh, if you want to know more details about this Samsung Galaxy S5 I've covered pretty much all of its important aspects on the channel so make sure to check out my other videos thanks for watching and I'll see you guys soon bye